President Obama's Christmas vacation continues this morning with the first family in Hawaii. He met with troops at Marine Corps Base Hawaii, where he thanked them for their service. Chip Reed is traveling with the president in Honolulu during a key time in the Afghanistan mission. Chip, good morning. Well, good morning. That's right. The U.S. combat mission officially ends on December 31st. The president thanked the troops for their service and said, we are safer today because there will never again be a terrorist attack launched on the United States from Afghanistan. Hello, everybody. Merry Christmas. It's become an annual tradition, a Christmas Day visit by the President and First Lady to Marine Corps Base Hawaii, where they thank service members and their families for their sacrifice. The greatest Christmas present we have uh, is uh, the finest military the world's ever known. The President also talked about the status of the war in Afghanistan. Next week, uh, we will be ending our combat mission in Afghanistan. Obviously... <laughs> Because of the extraordinary service of the men and women uh, in the American armed, so uh, armed Forces, Afghanistan has a chance to rebuild its own country. But the end of the combat mission does not mean the end of the war. From a peak of about 100,000 U.S. troops in Afghanistan, there are now about 10,600, and it will be two years before they all come home. Until then, U.S. forces will continue to be in harm's way, advising and assisting Afghan troops and engaging in counterterrorism operations. In six days here, the president has golfed four times, but he also gets daily briefings on national security. He issued a statement applauding Sony Pictures' decision to release the movie The Interview, and he asked Vice President Joe Biden to attend Saturday's funeral of a murdered police officer in New York City. He mixed business and pleasure in a round of golf with the Prime Minister of Malaysia, who was also vacationing in Hawaii. Clearly in an upbeat mood, Mr. Obama had some playful advice for the press. Uh, be careful about those uh, fruity drinks. <laughs> well, the camera didn't catch the last part of that statement. The president said, watch out for those fruity drinks. You never know. They may have a little kick in them. Anthony and Vanita, <laughs> apparently he cares about us more than we realized. <laughs> you know, Chip, while we have you in Hawaii, we want to ask you about the other headline that we've seen, that there's been some blizzard warnings in that area. <laughs> Well, maybe not exactly this area. On the big island of Hawaii, about 200 miles away from here, at 11,000 feet, there are some blizzard warnings. But here in Oahu, it's been averaging about 75 degrees, and the only sign of a white Christmas is the sand on that beach. Oh, you're making us all a bit jealous, Chip. Thank you so much. <laughs>